Okay, so as you guys can see, we're back at part two, and yeah, we're at the frozen island, which I'm about to show you guys something that we need to get first. Okay, we're at the frozen island, right? We gotta go to the ability teacher, and this is what we gotta get. We gotta get ourselves the aura, right? Once we get ourselves aura, we gotta learn it. And as you guys can see, what aura does is basically give you guys, you know, armament hockey right here. As you guys can see by my feet, it doesn't go to my hands because I don't have no fighting styles that use like my hands. So I'm using this fighting style for my feet. This is like, you know, for people who I'm attacking. And basically, if you guys just put this on while fighting people, you guys will get a boost. You guys will get a damage boost. So that's what I'm going to do. What else we can learn is also air jump. Air jump is basically $10,000. We already got this. So basically, I can jump in the air a lot. And also flash step. Flash step is a hundred thousand, which I'm about to learn. And it says you already know this building. Flash step is basically this. If I press R, I basically like flash. So yeah, that's all I got from this island right here. So make sure to come to this frozen island. And now we're gonna go to our destination since we're only level two hundred and you know three. We're gonna go to our destination over there. Okay, so the first thing before we go to the designated island that we're supposed to grind at, we're gonna get ourselves a fruit and let's see if we can get lucky right here. Let's see if we can get lucky. Let's go ahead and click, you know, click to retract. Random fruit, buy, and we get a magma. Oh my gosh, we get a magma. I'm gonna store it for later. Not gonna lie, I'm gonna store it for later. I'm gonna use ice for a little bit, but hey, we got magma. So yeah, now all we gotta do is just wait two more hours to get our next fruit. So we gonna we just kept the magma, right? Next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna see what's on the shop. There is Falcon. And yeah, the shop looks kind of cheeks. Not gonna lie. Let's go ahead and go grind. So yeah, after I got my fruit and after I check what's on stock, we're gonna go to the prison. You know what I'm saying? It says we have to go to the prison. So yeah, I'll see you guys till then. Okay, so now since we're here, we're just gonna keep on fighting these NPCs until I get to a high enough level, and I'll see you guys till then. Okay, we're gonna keep on fighting these prisoners and dangerous prisoners. So as you guys can see right now, I'm almost done beating this Chief Warden right here. Chief Warden is OP, but as you guys can see, I'm level 252, and this is what my stats are looking like right here. I put almost on everything on stats, and as you guys can see, we have 592 on melee. 163 on defense everything else is one we don't really have that much defense it's because i put mostly almost all on melee it's because i low-key want to kill the npcs faster so i can get my level higher and plus they won't be able to hit me because i have ice the only people who can be able to damage me are basically the bosses and that's it not the npcs so the bosses are like that guy right there there's like a guy in here. I killed the guy in there and I got this little mini, you know, pink swan thing. I don't know what it's called, but hey, this is what it is right here. The pink coat. Pink coat goes hard for a little bit until I get something better. But now, what we gotta do now is go to the next thing is the Coliseum. So we're gonna go all the way to the Coliseum and I'll see you guys till there. So yeah, as you guys can see, we're almost here by this big old Coliseum, right? This Coliseum looks lit. There is a PvP section right here where you can fight at, I believe, right here in the middle. And it has some crazy music that I have to mute because of copyright reasons. But yeah, this is where we're going to get our quest at, right? We're going to fight these Togo Warriors, 250. And I believe the Togo Warriors are right here, easily. Yeah, they're right here. So as you guys can see, they still cannot damage me, so I'm going to keep on just punching them. So yeah, I'm just going to punch these guys like once and then until they all swarm me, right? This is my method right here, and then I'm going to just kill them one by one again and again using my moves. And I'm going to keep on doing this until I get to like the next island, so yeah, you guys stay tuned. So yeah, as you guys can see, I'm at my last NPC of defeating the gladiators. Gladiators, my fault. I kind of messed up. But this is what my stats are looking like, and we're at 301, so on the next island we have to go to right here is basically we gotta go all the way to Magma Village. So Magma Village is like a long place, so I'm gonna go ahead and take this boat. We can't drive the boat supposedly. So yeah, I might as well just walk there I believe. We're just gonna walk there and my energy is kinda low, and I'll just see y'all to then.
so yeah we kind of made it to this island right here as you guys can see this is what magma village looks like and we're gonna go ahead and talk to the npc we're gonna make a home point we're gonna go ahead and make a home point right here except home point sets and now we gotta talk to the npc the mayor is the person we're supposed to talk to and then yeah we basically gotta fight military soldiers right these guys right here and no oh, they can do damage to you not gonna lie these guys can do damage so it's gonna be kind of tough so i'm gonna keep on grinding some levels and once i grind a lot of levels i'll see you guys today okay so now what i'm about to do right now is since we have like a decent amount of level right now we're at 341 right now i'm about to go get myself another fruit because it's been two hours since i've been grinding since we got from level 202 all the way to 341 and yeah i'm gonna grind for another two hours and i might call it a video y'all okay we're in it right now let's go see what we get from the fruits okay okay give me some good luck yes sir kitsune oh no 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 way no way no way no way no way we ruined kitsune what bro this is all my alt oh my gosh all right not gonna lie i got super lucky as you guys can see i'm still on my alt making this series and as you guys can see we still got the keys and let me unstore it hopefully i don't die but yeah as you guys see, we got Kitsune right here chilling. And I already got Perm Kitsune on my regular account. So I don't know. Should I give this away or not? Let me know. And yeah. Bro, I don't know why it's not hitting. But yeah, as you guys can see, I'm super close to trying to beat up the Magma boss. I believe if you guys don't kill him, if he kills you, he resets his health. So yeah, hopefully I did it right here. And I believe I just did it. So yeah. Now, next thing we gotta do is go to our next spot. It's the underwater city. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my stats before we go there. We got 891 on melee, 236 on defense. And we're currently at level 376. So yeah, we might as well go there right now. So yeah, this island right here was the most trickiest because as you guys can see, there's people with white swords and there's people with dark swords. And the people with dark swords can do damage to y'all. But hey, Thank goodness we got, got away with, you know what I'm saying, thank goodness we are going away from this island right here. This island was kind of difficult because, yeah, hockey is kind of crazy. But as you guys can see, we're going to go all the way to over here. So, yeah, I'll see you guys till then. So as you guys see, we're almost at our destination right here. All we gotta do is just go follow this. We gotta go to this circle right here to get to the underwater city. And I believe we'll be there once we get off the, you know, boat. All we gotta do is just go into here and boom, there we are. We're at underwater city. And now what I'm gonna do right now is I gotta fight NPCs right here that are low key stronger than me. So yeah, this is where the NPC boss is right here. You know what I'm saying? And I'm gonna keep on doing this until I get to a higher level. So yeah, I'll see you guys today. Okay, so I'm over here doing my task. As you guys can see, I still got this dark step fighting style. I'm about to go get the uh, sharpen fighting style right now. I'm gonna show you guys where it's at. As you guys know, we are in the underwater city. I don't know what it's called, but like, yeah, you guys can see my level's at 454. And I'm doing this series, you know, new to pro, and it's going by fast. We're gonna be to the third season soon, but yeah. We're going to go all the way right here. We're going to try to get into right here. Sneak into this crack. And you guys see, there's a water kung fu teacher. It says, hello. I'm going to say, what's up? Would you like to learn the water kung fu style for $750,000? This style allows the manipulation of water attacks on your opponent. It also has three special skills, which I can learn right now, which I'm about to learn. And boom, this is what the water kung fu style looks like right here. Literally, all you gotta do is just go into this like place right here. You know what I'm saying? It's it's located at the underwater city. You see you see the bosses right here. It's literally located behind this place right here. Literally, all you gotta do is just go right here, phase through here, and boom, you just talk to him right there. So that's how you guys can get yourself the water kung fu style. I advise you guys to get this to a level 400 because. You need almost every fighting style to get to level 400 so you guys can be able to max out, you know, so you guys can be able to get the uh, god human fighting style. But yeah, this is what the attacks look like right here. 
So yeah, as you guys can see, I got myself the new fighting style, Water Kung Fu. It goes crazy, right? Now the next thing we're gonna do right now is that we're basically gonna go to the next island, the Sky Island. You know, I'll say the Skylands. So yeah, I'll see you guys till then. Oh yeah, one thing I forgot to tell you guys, I'm gonna go get a fruit before I go to the Sky Island. So you guys already know the spot. But yeah, we're gonna go get ourselves a fruit. We're basically at level 456. We are already done grinding over there in the underwater city. You know what I'm saying? We got ourselves the Shark Man, you know, Water Kung Fu. And then now all we gotta do, this is what my stats look like right here. I got, you know, 238 levels on my defense, 1100 levels on my melee. So yeah, I'm putting a lot on melee, less on defense. Cause you know, my stats right now, I'm trying to kill NPCs fast. So yeah, we're gonna go get ourselves a fruit and yeah. So yeah, this is what we're gonna get. Let's see what fruit we get. We get a ghost fruit, a ghost fruit, a W ghost fruit for the first C. I'm gonna go ahead and, you know, store it and yeah. Okay, since I'm done doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and go to the Skylands. So yeah, let's go ahead and go to the Skylands. Okay, we finally made it here, and I believe we gotta go all the way up there. So that's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna go all the way up there. So yeah, as you guys can see, I made it to the Skylands, and yeah, that's basically it for part two. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate if you guys like and subscribe. That's basically it. So yeah, we're gonna be able to make part three soon. Well, I'm gonna make part three in a couple days, or probably tomorrow. It doesn't matter. But yeah, let me know what you guys think, and yeah.